In today's video, we're opening up the new Pharaoh Servant 25th Anniversary Booster Box until we pull every foil. Pharaoh Servant is the fourth set ever released to the Yu-Gi-Oh! TCG. It premiered in North America on October 20th, 2002. This set was a combination of the Japanese sets Curse of Anubis and Thousand Eyes Bible. Prominent cards in this set include Magical Hats, a trap card used by Yu-Gi that always got him out of the diciest situations. Buster Blader, the Dragon Destroyer. This card is used by Yu-Gi against Strings and Slifer the Sky Dragon's inaugural anime duel. Thousand Eyes Restrict, Pegasus Ace Monster. This horrifying monster immobilizes every monster on the field besides its Itself, making it a formidable monster to deal with in GOAT format. Finally, Genzo. This iconic machine monster was won by Joey Wheeler in a duel against Esperoba. It is considered one of the best secret rares in Yu-Gi-Oh! history in terms of collectability, and it was a very strong card in the TCG for many years. What's up guys, we're back with another opening. Until we pull every foil, we have Pharaoh Servant today. This is gonna be a fun one because obviously Genzo, and we've done three of these already. LOB, MRD, and SRL are all available on the channel. Go check them out if you guys haven't seen them yet. They were fun videos. Let's see if we can beat our fastest time, which was seven boxes to pull the entire holo set with Pharaoh Servant. But before we hop into it, we have a giveaway. We have away this booster box. All you have to do is like the video, be subscribed, turn on notifications. Let me know down below what's your favorite card for Pharaoh Servant that we pull or your favorite legacy card that's come out from these boxes. All right, let's get right into it because we know these are longer videos. It's going to take at least five boxes. The minimum we've had is seven so far. We would like to beat that at some point, Oni Tank rocks in 34. We will be looking for as many of those as possible because that is a classic card right there. The Oni Tank rocks in 34. Here we go. We have a Dust Tornado. Starting off with a super already. Our first hit is a super rare. One out of 22 down, 21 to go. Our final episode of this uh, series we have going on, which is basically Legacy Week 25th Anniversary Edition. I have a playlist. If you guys haven't seen the others, go check out the playlist. I will have it at the end card and it can pop up on the screen. If you guys haven't seen it, it'll be on my channel. But we have Invasion of Chaos tomorrow. So that's our final episode. Then we have a live stream on Tuesday. So I hope to see you guys there. Don't know exactly what we're doing yet because we're going to have pulled every foil. I'm going to try to think of something fun. Like maybe we'll go for Exodia at a LOB, but it'll, you know, might have a little twist to it. Premature Burial starting off with an ultra rare. Very nice. All right. One ultra, one super already off to a great start. The question is how early will we pull Genzo? How many Genzos will we pull? Will we get one every box? or a secret or every box like we have been on average we'll have to find out there's a couple that well there was a couple that didn't have secret i think two total and then there's one that had two secrets in our uh, past few openings we have a mirror wall another super rare has been pulled three out of 22 down keep it going jinzo i am looking for you wouldn't be a pharaoh servant opening a rux and video without pulling jinzo right i mean and we're pulling all the foils today unless it was like yesterday where we almost didn't pull every foil that was a uh, borderline we got it on the last box we have dimension hole we have a drill bug, very cool. Let's do this, we need some luck today. Hopefully you guys have been enjoying this series, enjoying the booster boxes. If you guys have not ordered any yet, Sassy Auto does have a link down below in the description. You can use my code for 5% off if you wanna grab some. Also, we have just released the Duelist Nexus discounts, which is coming out in a little bit less than two weeks at the time of seeing this. Duelist Nexus is the next set. It has 25 quarter century secret rares in it. Uh, one of them being that special one. It's like the magician soul thing. I don't remember what it's called. Super rare Parasite Parasite. That is in the next three sets, but it has a different background color, which is pretty interesting. They've never done anything like that before. So if you guys want to pre-order either of, well, you don't have to pre-order these. These are available now, but if you want to pre-order Duelist Nexus, uh, that will be available down below. Also, the tins are probably going to be available at the time of recording this as well. We're going to have a pre-order up with a discount code for the Mega Tins, which is going to be insane this year so if you want to see those there's an oni tank rocks in 34 second one of the day so if you want any of that stuff go check it out it is an affiliate link with me so it supports the channel it helps out sassiato as well because he is the seller and he is a good friend of the channel he sponsored uh, our 200k specials and stuff so he's a legend so it's a win-win-win then you get awesome products so go check it out down below we have beast of tower ultra rare that's five out of 22 the first box always gets you the best you know value because it's all new cards you haven't pulled anything yet unless you get a double sum out of one box i don't know how that would happen but maybe it would gravity bind so many crazy cards in pharaoh servant like playable uh, you know nostalgic anime reference i mean it's just a great great set we have a limiter removal that's another new one. We are four out of 10 on the supers already. Good start. Can we pull a secret? We have not done that yet. Still looking for a secret rare. We have a morphing jar. New and Odin's. Lots of packs to potentially pull everything that we want. Imperial order. So no Genzo in the first box. That's okay. Secret rare. We have our seven out of 22 that comes in the first box. It's basically guaranteed unless you don't get a secret or something or get one ultra, which is possible. I had one box like that yesterday, I think. 
Okay, it might have been two videos ago, not sure. All right, let's go. DNA surgery, we have a vampire baby. Solemn wishes and respect play, good stuff. Good, good stuff. Hopefully you guys are having a great day watching this and enjoying the long video. Hopefully you have your popcorn, it's popcorn time. Maybe lunch, it might be lunch time for a lot of you guys. It's when I release it, lunch time around my time at least. I know there's a lot of people watching from around the world though. We have Nobleman of Crossout, which is always pretty cool. People watching from Australia, you know, Europe. Germany is a big one. A lot of you guys in Germany. Shout out to you guys. The Germans watching the Ruxin 34 content. I appreciate you guys. Oni Tank Ruxin 34. Nice. Lots of packs to go. We have pulled already a bunch of different foils. We've got eight different ones so far out of 22. Maybe Pharaoh Servant can be our absolute fastest. We've always had great luck with Pharaoh Servant, so maybe this can be it. Chain Destruction. Usually one that you don't want to pull, but I am super happy to pull it for the first time and hopefully never again in this opening. We want to pull it one time. We don't want any doubles of that card. Now we're still looking for that Jinzo. We're looking for that Buster Blader, that Thousand Eyes Restrict. Haven't pulled any of those. Grave Robber, another unique one. Wow, good start right now. We're already up to 10 out of 22, and we have just barely started. I think we're on the second box, so... If we can get the right RNG, we could potentially... That's another new one, Fairy Meteor Crush. That's already seven of the supers in the first couple boxes. No repeats yet. I'm going to jinx this for sure. We're definitely about to get one. Monster Recovery and a Sword Hunter. Good stuff. Good stuff, but what a great start. We just need that Genzo. We need another Ultra here, and we are looking real good. We have a Insect Imitation. Another awesome card. Let's keep it going. We have three added Guido. We have a vampire baby and the baby vampire. All right, next pack. Let's see. Will it have the Jinzo inside? Let's see. No skull invitation. Okay, maybe the next time. Can we get that secret rare Jinzo? We have a limiter removal. That's our first double of the day. Okay, it took 11 foils to get a double. That's not bad. We need a Jinzo. We pulled 11 foils without a Jinzo so far. That's pretty, uh, pretty insane that we've pulled so few double i mean we've got one double right now we definitely jinxed it earlier you know right before but we can do this we can pull another ultra that we need come on we have a insect barrier come on give it to us Ooh, a thousand eyes restrict ultra rare one of the best cards you can pull and a unique ultra so we are on a really good pace right now with 12 unique foils already all right next pack here we go can we get that genzo over halfway through no genzo yet only tank rucks on 34 good to see that already feral servant is starting off with great luck Will they be able to beat LOB with the... Oh, a double Imperial Order. No, that's not a Jinzo. Will they be able to beat LOB seven boxes? That's been the best one so far. Darkfire number two. Major Riot. Okay, we're still looking. Still need three supers. We need six ultras. We need one secret. Still a lot that we need to complete this set. We have Dokuro Yaiba. All right, couple doubles. Not bad for 14 total foils, 12 being unique. That's not bad at all. We have a Armored Glass. Solemn we shits. Let's go. We have Gift of the Mystical Elf. We have a Sword Hunter. Kisa tie with that little finger. Can we get a Ceasefire? That is a new Ultra Rare as well. All right, we'll take it. Halfway through and then an Oni Tank Rux in 34. Not a bad pack there. Okay, so we are up to 13 out of 22 foils with half of the Ultras down. Very good start today. Very, very good start. Let's see if we can continue it and keep pulling awesome stuff. We have a Magical Hats, another new one. This is insane. We already have 14 foils out of 22. We basically just started, it feels like. Incredible luck, but will it turn at some point or will we continue to get this lucky and just keep pulling the cards that we need? Enchanted Javelin, Magic Drain, that is nothing. Can we pull an awesome Jinzo? What, Jinzo is really holding off though. We've pulled all these other foils, have not pulled Jinzo yet. We got a double Imperial Order so far, which you don't really love to see. We have a Insect Barrier and Insect Barrier, I should say. Come on, we need this luck to continue. Prohibition, very nice card. Can we beat LOB seven boxes? Gear Free, the Iron Knight, another new super rare. I think we only need one more. Nine supers, five ultras, one secret. Wow, that gives us 15 out of 22. We need one more super. That is insane already. Been really lucky with the ultras as well. The only repeats we've really gotten one super, one secret. Can we get a nice ultra unique to... Oh, a backup soldier! That's all the supers! No way! All the supers already! It's been like two and a half boxes. We, we haven't even pulled three boxes worth of supers. We have all the supers already. That is the almost the best possible luck. The only way it could have been better is if we didn't get a double limiter removal. We could have gotten it one super ago. That is impressively awesome. Will the ultras be unique as well? And will we get lucky? and get them very quickly. Let's find out. We have a bubonic vermin. 
Pure order. Still no Genzo, though. That could be interesting if we got everything besides the Genzo. That would be some crazy. Oh, Legendary Fisherman. Another one that we don't have. We are now at 6 out of 10 Ultras. 20 tank, Rux and 34. That puts us at 17 out of 22 on like the third box. This is crazy. This luck has been really crazy. But the question is, will it turn around? Because all it takes is, you know, start pulling doubles and it can really slow you down. No Genzo yet still. That's crazy. That's usually the secret rares are some of the easier ones to pull. Mirror wall, obviously that's going to be a double because we have all of them already. All the supers now, we're going to be, you know, we're going to have doubles of those. Can we get a Genzo? There it is. Our first Genzo secret rare of the opening. That puts us at, oh my, we are almost at 18 out of 22 already. So literally three boxes and we have 18 out of 22 foils. That's insane. Now we just got to get lucky with the ultra rares. We could finish this in the minimum five boxes if we get extremely lucky. Uh, I don't think it's going to happen, but it could happen. I think the, the absolute minimum if you're pulling two ultras is five boxes. If you do get a three ultra that could speed it up a little bit, but then you would also still need two, three ultra boxes because one, one ultra isn't going to help you enough to not have to open the fifth box. Okay, morphing jar number two. Let's keep it going. Some been some great luck today, actually. Really, really good luck. Enchanted Javelin. I mean, I'm gonna be amazed if we could beat LOB. That was already a really fast uh, time getting, you know, get in seven boxes. But if we can get in five, that would be pretty impressive. This is a new speed running challenge. Let's see if we can get, ooh, Fiend Mega Cyber. Let's go, another ultra rare. <laughs> Let's go, we're at 19 out of 22. There's no way this happens. There is no way we don't pull a double ultra rare. That is impossible. That is impossible. 0% chance this happens. Parasite, Parasite, of course, that's a double. We already have 10. Absolutely no possible way. By the way, we haven't pulled Buster Blader yet. Just throwing that out there. Um, that is one of the big ones that we have not pulled. What else have we not pulled? We've already pulled Premat. We haven't pulled Call of the Haunted. So we need Call of the Haunted. We need Buster Blader. And then uh, I feel like there's a there's like a, a terrible one we haven't pulled yet. But I can't think of what it is. I don't remember. Maybe we'll find out. I mean, there's no way we're, there's no way we're not opening another box. There's no way that would just be too insane. We have a sword hunter. Okay, Sky Scout could be the bit the greatest opening of all time in terms of quickness and like getting the cards that you need in the minimum amount of opening. But it's not going to happen. It's not going to happen. Dust Tornado is a double. Very few doubles in the double stack at the moment. I'm sure that will change soon. Now that we're down to only needing three ultra rares, backup soldier. Okay, yeah, getting supers, they're obviously going to be doubles. Let's see. We have a Numinous Healer. Awesome. Can we get those last three ultra rares? We have a Infinite Dismissal. You should die with that little finger. Probably going to come down to one, and we're just going to open like five boxes searching for the last one. Probably the Buster Blader, you know, with how the series is gone. We got this. We have a Call of the Haunted. There's one we needed. Oh my gosh. No, there's no way. There is no way. We are at 20 out of 22 foils. It is impossible for us to pull all unique ultras. There's an OD tank, Rux and 34. Should have been an ultra, to be honest. So we need Buster Blader and we need one other card. What is the other card? Limiter removal. Is there any more? We've already got Thousand Eyes. I don't think there's another fusion, is there? Could be a spell. But I think Premature Burial is the only one. Maybe it is a trap. Another trap. Why do I feel like it's another like kind of garbage trap? But I can't remember what it is. We've already had Chain Destruction, and that might have been the one I was kind of thinking of. Hmm, I don't know actually what that is. Maybe we'll figure it out. Genzo again! All right, another Genzo. That's awesome. We got our four secret rares so far. Will we get five and get, you know, one in every box in this opening? We'll find out. Oni Tank Rux and 34. Here we go. Send us that luck. We have Driving Snow, Mad Sword Beast, Mr. Volcano, and his Flaming Finger. We have Garuchin Kuwagata, Grave Robber. Okay, I'm just waiting for that double ultra to come. I know it's going to happen in this box. Here it comes. Cold Wave. Appropriate. Here it comes. Double Thousand Eyes Restrict or Legendary Fisherman or, or Premat, please. If it's going to be anything. Doku Royaiba. Or Call of the Hunter wouldn't be bad either. We have Solomon's Law Book. We have a Nobleman of Extermination. Only Tank Rocks at 34. That's always at the end of the pack for some reason. I always almost miss it. This is the last card. We have a Goblin Attack Force. That was the other one. Goblin Attack Force. We're literally one away. We are one away with our fifth box right here. All we have to pull is a Buster Blader, which I have already pulled in our first opening. And of course, now I need it. Uh, it's always one of the best cards at the end. It's insane. If there is a Buster Blader in this box, this is insane. We just picked the perfect box as magical hats. Cool. Wow. Hopefully another Genzo too. We have two Genzos, two Imperial Orders right now. It'd be nice to get three Genzos. Uh, Flame Champ. Now bless us with an epic pull. If we get it in five boxes, this is literally insane. Hope you guys have enjoyed this so far. It's been one of the craziest openings of these five so far, for sure. Our fourth overall, we have Invasion of Chaos tomorrow. 
Now Invasion of Chaos is going to take us like a, like forever. It's going to take like two hours to kill all of them probably. Based on how well this is going. We have a gear free the Iron Knight. Will there be a Buster Blader? I don't know. There's going to be one more Ultra. I'm starting to believe, guys. I'm starting to believe in the heart of the cards here. At first I was like, no way. There's no possible way. We're going to get doubles. And now it just seems like fate. Will it be, will it be the case? Or will it smack us in the face with some double? We have a Numinous Healer, Oni Tank, Rux, and 34. All right, here we go. Steel Ogre Grotto, we have a Buster Blader! I knew it! I had the feeling this is insane. That is officially it. Easily our fastest video to all the foils. We opened the minimum number of boxes. We didn't even finish the fifth box. And we opened all the foil cards in the set. That was absolutely insane. If you guys enjoyed the video, make sure to subscribe and go check out the other videos from this series. They are right here and there will be a new one tomorrow and then a live stream Tuesday. So hope to see you there. Shout out to Tome Flow Show, Daxer, JT Cho, Puffins of Doom, Ernesto Dienda, Micycle, America Doyster, Supreme Stage 21, Ananda Tai Show, Ian Musa, Junior Barding, and Mimic Echo. Thank you guys for supporting the channel and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.